Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Milky TD here back with another video on the channel and today we got the top three easiest strategies for beginners. So if you guys are new, be sure to drop a like and subscribe. I plan on doing more future content like this and if you guys are from my community already, stick around because I will be streaming uh, sometime. I don't know when, but I do do a lot of streams. Anyways, let's get right into the video. So the third best strategy in BTD battles has to be Dart Farm Wiz. This strategy is a classic. Everyone pretty much knows this strategy. And Dart is a great early game tower and mid game tower. As well as pretty good late game tower if you have the fan club unlocked. And Wiz is also solid. It's a pretty simple strategy. Uh, it's really hard to mess up with this strategy. I have and. These are for newer players, so most likely you're going to be playing under Ceramic Crucible or even at Ceramic Crucible level. So all you have to worry about is pretty much games end before BFBs are sent or the Red Balloons. So uh, if they send you like a Moab or something, you can boost with your Triple Darts and Dragon's Breath. Or you can Fan Club it if you don't have a boost. And yeah, the strat's easy. If they all out you round 13, you can Fan Club or you can boost with like Dragon's Breath and some Spolts or Jugs. Pretty standard. So our number two on this list is Boat Farm Boomer. Again, another simple strategy, but this is for water maps. So obviously the boat is pretty solid uh, on water maps. It's the best water tower. There's only two of them, but Grape Shot and Faster Shooting can pretty much take care of anything. Uh, boat's definitely a top tower in the game. Farm, you know, not, you can't go wrong with farms. Be sure to farm with this strategy. And Boomer is a really good mid, mid to um, early game tower. It's not the best early game because of how expensive it is, but mid game, the the boomer and the turbocharge are really solid upgrades and like i said it, these are going to be for under ceramic crucible so if you're one of those people all you got to worry about is pretty much defending round 13 and perhaps a couple moabs and even if they send you a bfb you have the boat pull ability from the boat and if they all you round 13 you can just turbocharge and boost and that should pretty much defend now the easiest strategy in my opinion for beginners is going to be tack farm mortar reason being is tack farm mortar is really good at defending rushes it's not the best late game but like i said you're most likely not going to make it late game before you have a chance to kill them so what um this strategy is really good because the tax shooter is really good early game and the mortar de can decamoize the balloons so your tax shooter can pretty much hit everything and mid game obviously more attack good combo and you can if anything gets scary you can just maelstrom the rush and you guys will most likely be fine to it so yeah also mob you can um maelstrom and a bfp will be a little bit trickier so you want to try to kill them before a bfp anyways thanks uh, for watching the video i hope this is really helpful for you newer players and subscribe for more videos like this all right see you guys later bye